We have a question from uh, June or Jun. I'm 63 years old, 188 pounds, and skinny fat. Uh, for those who don't know, skinny fat, it's a condition uh, where the person like might look really, really good in clothes, but when you see them on the beach, they, they there's not a lot of, uh, the word we used to use is tone. Uh, um, my friend Josh Hillis does a really good job explaining that on his blog. I'm interested in training that includes strength work, mobility, and plyometrics. Would this be a good approach? And if so, how would you recommend finding such a program? Well, <laughs> what you're basically describing is a, is a program that I would have for about a oh, 19 to 34-year-old uh, elite athlete. Um, you're 63. This idea of doing plyometrics, uh, great word. We all love them. Thanks to Fred Wilk for coming up with the phrase, um, term. Uh, if you read the research, and it's a good idea to do that sometimes, you'll find that the original uh, people who studied plyos recommended that until you have a double body weight squat, you're not going to get any benefit out of them. And so for you, you'd have to be putting, you know, in the neighborhood of 360 or so in the back squat before you get anything out of them. Um, you have here strength work. There's real value in strength work. It's an adult uh, mobility work. I think there's real value. Um, the plyometrics is the one. I'd like to know why you put that in there because that it just seems to leap right off the page at me. Um, certainly, uh, I'm a big believer in uh, for an adult doing things like high knee running, uh, what we call butt kickers, that weird little drill where you, as you run, you hit your butt with your heels. Uh, stadium steps, uh, running up hills. Um, jumping up on a box and then stepping back down. But uh, un until you get your hands on the skinny fat thing, I, I can, I just think you're putting your joints, uh, I mean, you make one mistake and you're going to get hurt on these. Um, for your basics at your age, I don't know why you just go, go to Ganjon University and just pump into the workout generator. Um, to me, what you're asking for uh, is this, an entirely basic program. Uh, the first question I would ask you, no matter what, is what equipment do you have? What do you know how to do? How many days a week do you want to train? How long? And that literally is the beginner's, uh, the beginner program you want is what the workout generator provides. Uh, someone got on me online for selling the, my site too much. I'm like, well, it's because I put the site together because of this kind of question. So, um, Personally, I think you should just do a very basic program, push, pull, hinge, squat, loaded, carry, appropriate reps, appropriate sets, some variation, uh, some learning, uh, learn how to do different movements over time. Um, and, and you're going to make great progress very quickly uh, on this. So I wouldn't worry too much. So Dan John University, answer the questions on the workout generator and get started, okay? Thank you.